not far from the District of Columbia. We're in College Park, Maryland, getting ready for an exciting game. And now we bring you the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Stout is lined up and just about ready to send this one off as we're ready to get this game underway. Excellent kick. He's to the 20. Brought down at the 29. Maryland's coaches admitted to us that they game plan around this guy. It's kind of different for a wide receiver. It's usually a running back or a quarterback, but he's paid off for him so far. He really has. And I, I found it very refreshing as we travel around the country and visit with so many of these players to find a high-profile wide receiver who's a selfless guy. He's a great leader from everything that they Throws into coverage, just picked off. And he hits him hard at the 30. He telegraphed that throw. He eyed his receiver the whole way. That was an easy read by the defense. From the 30-yard line, first down. Complete right down, nothing to do it. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. Quick pass. Tackle around the 17-yard line. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. Strike to his receiver, no good. Pretty good effort here by the quarterback of trying to squeeze that ball into a tight spot. I know it was incomplete, but he didn't have too many other options. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And he carries the ball for a nice game. tight end in and out of his hands this one should be makeable Penn State could take the lead with this field goal they try to get a head start there maybe he got the cadence wrong coming out of the huddle the coaches have a low threshold for mistakes like that It's up, and the field goal is good. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20. At the 30. And he's tackled at the 41-yard line. Penn State's really got things working right now. I can't think of a better start. That's exactly where they had hoped to see this game go. I mean, anytime you can start the game with a stop, get your offense out there, they move the ball down, put points on the board. Now it's just more about trying to maintain what they've already created. With that man open, and he dropped it. From their own 41-yard line, it's second down. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. He didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. Throws a laser across the middle, and he's taken down around the 45-yard line. You know, if you use him in this offense the right way, it's almost like you have an extra wide receiver. He's that good. Zips it to the tight end. And he's tackled around the 39-yard line. Number one with the tackle at the 39-yard line. So it's second down now. They need about four yards to pick up the first. Throws complete, and he's hit hard behind the line. They get a one-yard loss on that one. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. Mike 13. 
They go to the screen here, and the halfback's got it. And down he goes at the 38-yard line. A yard, maybe two on the screen pass. It's fourth down. They'll line it up for a very long field goal attempt. Maryland is down three and looking to tie it up. Kicks up. No good. He hooked it left. Well, sometimes when you see a kick like that, the kicker is trying to compensate for a factor, maybe like the wind, and he thinks he can hook it back in. It didn't happen that time. Penn State is up by three. Here's a screen pass. Gets it to the back. And they make the stop at about the 39-yard line. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. He's taken down at the 49. I like how the offense is using the pass to get him involved. He's explosive, and you just want to get the ball in his hands. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Game of seven yards. That will make it second and four. Tackled after a decent pickup. That's a gain of four on the play. Yeah, let's get a sack lunch. First down. Throws it to the halfback on the screen. They'll bring him down at the 36. From the 36-yard line. Second down. Somebody jumped early down there. Ball start. Offense. Little stumbles like these can kill your offensive progress. Still second down. the 32-yard line. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. Concentration Automatic lapse right there. Down. The coaches will be giving them an earful for it, too. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 17-yard line. Penn State has a three-point lead. He's tackled at about the 21. This is the ninth play of this drive. Gets out to around the six. Brad, you just don't see this very often anymore in college football. That is their fifth first down on this drive alone. They have great rhythm right now as an offense. And look at that poor defense. They're looking over to the sidelines to the defensive coordinator for some help. They need to change. Touchdown, Nittany Lions. He makes the PAT. So a nine-play, 56-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well-executed touchdown drive. Tackle at the 19-yard line. Penn State's got a great defensive game plan, and it's working right now. Well, even from up here, Brad, you can see their defensive speed, and they're just playing with kind of an aggressive attitude. They're going to have to maintain that to slow down this offense. made right around the 22 yard line the back gets three on the carry Woo. i think everybody in the stadium felt that hit he really laid some lumber there from their own 22 yard line it's second down and he's tackled after positive yardage that'll make it third and one Go. 
makes it to the 41. We've played one quarter. The Nittany Lions in front, 10-0. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Quick throw. Not that impressive of a play. Let's see if they continue to employ the short passing game or if they decide to run the ball. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 44. Here's a throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. Game of one yard. That'll bring up third and six. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. That's a game of five on the play. That'll bring up fourth and one. Dotson is back to receive. Sometimes it's not the huge distance, but precision that you need from your punter. Nicely done. It was a pretty one-sided first quarter, but I wouldn't be surprised if things changed in a big way before halftime. Quick out to his receiver. Tackle at the 10. That play was going nowhere. Yeah, give a lot of credit to the defense here, recognizing pass and swarming to the receiver. They'll spread the field with five wide. Fires quickly to the tight end, and he's taken down at the 19. Moses with the tackle at the 19-yard line. That'll bring up third and inches. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Stout to punt. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He's at midfield. Tackle made at the 49-yard line. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with. Because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game. The offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead. They go to the back, and he's hit immediately in the backfield. That was well defended by this defense. The offensive line is so concerned with their penetrating abilities that these linebackers are able to roam free and make plays like that. Second down, 13 yards to go. Ball on the 48-yard line. Halfback's got it on a quick throw. And he's tackled at the 40-yard line. Quarterback and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. Second timeout. It's second and eight. Ball on the 16-yard line. Fires out quickly to the tailback. 
Touchdown, Terrapins! Here's the extra point to draw within three points. And he tacks on the extra point. It was a seven-play, 47-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. Fred, I thought the offense did a really nice job of mixing up the play calling on that drive. I thought the defense was on its heels most of the drive because of the versatility of the offense. So our score, 10-7. He's to the 20. He's knocked out of bounds at the 33-yard line. Well, it's always fun to be part of a defensive battle, and that's certainly what we have right now. Yeah, give credit to both of these defenses. I mean, they, they're playing with a lot of energy, and I think they're doing a nice job up front at the line of scrimmage. And at this point, they're not giving this either of these offenses a chance to make a play. Penn State holds a field goal lead. Caught, open field. He's out of bounds at about the 35. It's second down and eight. Ball on their own 35. He scrambled. They bring him down. Catches it, and he's looking for more. And he tackles him hard at the 41. Maryland's called their final timeout. The punting team's got to give their kickers some time. He's out to the 30. He makes it to the 28-yard line. The Terrapins struggling trying to get their star wide receiver in this game, and sometimes... You know, Herbie, it's almost like uh, a jump shooter in basketball. Get him to the free throw line, get him one free one from 15 feet and see how he can do. they got to get the ball in his hand somehow. I agree with you 100%. I mean, it's just a matter of just one touch. One touch could get this guy going because he has that kind of ability. And up to this point, they've not been able to find a way to get him the ball. Give credit, a lot of credit to this defense for coming in with a good plan. But now it's up to the offense to make their own adjustments to kind of counter that attack by this defense to be able to get the, the ball into the hands of their go-to guy. He gets out to about the 25-yard line. The Nittany Lions will use their first time out of the half. Third and about 13 yards. Ball on the 25. Makes it out to about the 33. The Nittany Lions call a timeout. That's their second of the half. That'll make it fourth and six. Dotson back deep to return. Gets to about the 41-yard line. Low scoring first half of play, but a close game. The Nittany Lions in great first half. Hopefully the second half's as good. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. They're set to go for another round. Penn State is up a field goal. And down he goes at the 34-yard line. That's good for a gain of nine yards. That brings up second and one. Quick throw, and he's got his man again. He's at midfield. He gets hit out of bounds around the 29-yard line. Gain of 37 on the play. First down. Gets out to around the 18. That's good for a game of 11 yards. That makes it first and 10. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Nice run to the outside. That's a game of seven on the play. That'll bring up second and three. A 
on the ground inside. Nice run there. That makes it first and goal. He's on the run. And they make the stop at the three. That brings up a second and goal. Ball on the three. Nice move, and he scores. This is what an offensive lineman hopes for, an opportunity to impose his will on the defense. And he hits the PAT. So a seven play, 75 yard drive, and a touchdown's a result. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He'll return it from the three. And he's taken down at the 29. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Throws complete. He's got room to work. He's taken down right around the 36-yard line. So it's second down and about two yards to go. Makes it out to about the 49. He's going to air it long. It's intercepted. It took a big deflection and the defender's presence of mind to grab it for the pick. First and 10. Ball on the 25-yard line. He might have a chance. Tackled outside after a nice pickup. Good for a game of six yards. That brings up second and five. Looking right. Intercepted. To the 20. The 10. Touchdown, Terps. Here's the extra point to get within a field goal. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He's to the 20. He's tackled at the 28. The Terrapins have really surprised everybody in this football game. They have not been intimidated at all, which is great to see. The attitude and effort of this team's put them in a position where they got a shot to win this game here in the second half. Let's see how the defense responds now, coming off that big play just a moment ago. You know, after that last turnover by this offense, the momentum has really turned in this game. And right now, you got to believe this defense is going to come out and play with a lot of intensity and a lot of aggression. Penn State is up by three. Throws it in a hurry, and he hits him hard at the 36. He's into the open field. Tackle made at the 44-yard line. First down. Scrambling around. 
And they got it. Absolutely perfect call by the defensive coordinator. He brought just the right amount of pressure from the right direction, and it seemed to confuse the offense. From their own 42-yard line, it's second down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Quick throw out to the receiver. They'll bring him down at the 43. That makes it first and ten. Five wide. Quick pass. Brought down at the 32-yard line. Gain of 11 yards. First down. He's tackled at the 24. Smith with the tackle at the 24-yard line. That makes it second and two. They'll line up with five wide receivers. They bring him down in the backfield. That's a loss of three yards on the play. This is the ninth play of this drive. Penn State has a three-point lead. He's under some heat. That's a great tackle at the 32. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. It has the distance, and he just drilled it from long range. Stout has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. He's to the 20. Whoa, he just took a licking. Penn State's continuing to play extremely tough defense. This has been impressive. It's just been impressive to watch them play with such an attitude, almost a chip on their shoulder with the energy that they're playing with. And I think it's going to require that kind of effort to be able to win this game. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. From their own 27-yard line. Second down. Fires it out. And he's taken down to the 38-yard line. And the safety with the interception. He's got an opening. To the 10. And he's all the way in for the touchdown. So a great play by the defender to give his team six points. That was a very good play, and that will certainly help build his team's momentum. He makes the PAT. So at the end of three, Penn State leads 27-14. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Jarrett deep to return. Jarrett from the three. He's to the 20. He's taken down at the 23. We've seen some mistakes from this quarterback tonight, Kirk. Well, it may seem obvious right now, but if you don't take care of the football, you're just not going to win many football games. I'm sure he wanted to impress the home crowd, but he hasn't given them a lot to cheer about. 
All right, we're just about set to start action here again in the fourth quarter. It's going to be interesting now to see if this quarterback can put that last throw behind him. This quarterback needs to be a little bit more careful because this defense is excellent on capitalizing off the of mistakes. Fires incomplete. From their own 23-yard line, second down. Quick throw, incomplete, one of his receiver. From the intended receiver on the play. That brings up third and ten. Three down, three down. Mike 13, Mike 13. And he's hit immediately. Good job here by the receiver. Look the ball in and ensure he has possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. From their own 45-yard line, it's first down. A junior makes the catch. And he's tackled around the 44-yard line. knows that the linebackers are cheating up a little bit on the run. If they can get some protection, they might want to open up a little bit of space for some passes underneath. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Got a man tackled for a loss. Number 91 makes the tackle at the 27 yard line. That'll bring up third and long. So another third down here, and this time it's third and long. Fires quickly. He's got the tailback on another catch. Steps out of bounds at the 17. It was a well-designed and executed pattern, but on third down and forever, it just wasn't enough. Just under three to go in regulation. Throwing right. They knock it down, incomplete. And they're going to have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long. Not much you can do there. you got to go for it and give yourselves a chance. Nine times out of ten, the defense will make a stop on that play. But, you know, based on the situation, this offense did have to go for it. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. They'll drop in for a loss. We've got a second and 11. Ball on the 16-yard line. to about the 17-yard line. The Terrapins will use their first time out of the half. Quick pass, man open, and he dropped it. Stop is the punter. Booming kick. 
He gets out to about the 45-yard line. The quarterback leads the offense back out onto the field as we get set to resume play. He gets rid of this one. Great job by the defense of getting after that quarterback. And right now, I think they've got him with some happy feet. He appears to be a bit rattled. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 45. Just under two minutes in the game. Quick strike to the receiver. And down he goes at the 41-yard line. He throws it. Picked off. Big time interception, and this game's over. First and ten. Ball on their own 12. the stop right around the 14 yard line Maryland's gonna have to use their second time out of the half he gets to about the 27 yard line Maryland will take their last time out After positive yardage. Call it a gain of five yards. That brings up second and five. From their own 32-yard line. It's second down. Here he goes. He gets to about the 41-yard line. Call the gain of nine yards. First down. Terrapins, I'm sure, are secure in the knowledge that despite this setback today, they still have one of the best players in the country. Well, this is a devastating loss, but it's one that they're going to have to put behind them. And, and as you said, they still have one of the best players in the country. They don't need to deviate their plan, get back to really what they know, and that's getting the ball to their star player. And next week, I'm sure they'll be fine.